So we will discuss the um, probable insight questions from the chapter If I Were You. Okay. Okay, the very first question. Write down the very first question. What was Gerard's reaction? What was Gerard's reaction when he met the intruder? What was Gerard's reaction when he met the intruder? Okay, for answer you need to mention that um, although he was surprised to have an intruder with a pis with a pistol although he was surprised to have an intruder with a pistol but he reacted in a very cool manner cool and calm manner okay means he did not panicked he did not freaked out he did not freak out he was very um, he was very much uh, in control he was very cool and he was trying to make joke out of it okay Okay. Give a brief sketch. Next question, give a brief sketch of Gerard. Give a brief sketch of Gerard's character. Give a brief sketch of Gerard's character. So first thing that you can talk about Gerard that he was very intelligent. Okay, he was very witty. Witty or intelligent. You can write witty or intelligent. Next, another character is there that is humorous. Yes, witty. W-I-T-T-Y. Witty or intelligent um and he was very uh, what to say humorous because he is having that uh, ability to um, make joke on anything so humorous is another character another character what you can understand you can tell me you also tell one character of gerard Yes, this club, uh, this video will be uploaded. Yes, he was very calm minded, not calm brain, calm minded. Okay, and he was very agile, not emotional. He was very agile, he was not at all emotional. Okay, he was very like funny and clever and agile. Okay. Yes, sense of humor, handle the adverse situation. Yes, he was smart, he was agile. Agile means he um, is not so slow. He can act very fast because when he was putting that, uh, means when he was locking the uh, intruder inside the cupboard he did it in a very fast motion so obviously he was physically very agile physically very active okay okay yes Raima here the question was about his character so playwright is his identity playwright where he used to live 
uh, these all are his identity but you just need to write intelligent person good sense of humor agile calm and cool minded okay he was smart he knew how to handle the adverse situation this all you can write okay yes what uposthit buddhi okay uh that is called uh like witty witty means everything okay no witty is fine intelligent and witty if you use both the words together that means he was very very smart and he can he is having that ability to think quickly immediately okay another very important um, character that i forgot to tell you one very very important character um, characteristics of gerard that is tell me very very important characteristics which which actually helped to save himself any idea any idea okay he was very creative he made up a story instantly he made up a plot instantly so he was very creative obviously he was a playwright that was his work professionally he was a playwright but he was indeed a very creative person and he can make up story at any point of time okay yes courageous is also there obviously so creative and courageous you can add okay next next is uh, what was the intruder's speciality of crime what was the intruder's speciality on crime what was the intruder's speciality on crime answer you know that he was he was having the speciality on jewel robbery okay next what was the big surprise what was the big surprise given by the intruder what was the big surprise given by the intruder what was the big surprise given by the intruder so the big surprise was that he is he revealed his intention to kill him yes to kill him that was the big surprise that revealing the intention okay what was the intruder's intention behind killing him what was the intruder's intention behind killing him means why did he plan to kill him what was the intruder's intention behind killing him yes he wanted to get freedom he wanted to live with his identity he wanted to live with gerard's identity and he wished to have uh, he wished to live a free life without running uh without running and hiding from the police okay so just mention that he wanted to live with gerard's identity as gerard himself and uh, that would save him from 
the constant um, threat of the police okay or any way possible you write on your own okay next you see page number 141 page number 141 in most melodramas the villain is foolish enough to delay his killing long enough to be frustrated you are much luckier okay this part you mark this part why did why did gerard called him lucky um, call him luckier page number 141 last dialogue in most melodramas the villain is foolish enough to delay his killing long enough to be frustrated you are much luckier yes this also correct ridita yes possible okay why luckier any idea why did gerard call him to be luckier as a villain okay so listen this part very carefully so normally he is telling in most of the melodramas in most of the dra theatrical dramas what happens the villain takes a long time to kill and finally when the time comes to kill he was not a, he won't be able to kill and he the villain will remain frustrated that i should have killed him before but here this um, uh, intruder will be luckier because he is also taking long time to kill him and as he is taking long time to kill him he is saving himself from committing a very big mistake and thus after knowing the truth he will not feel frustrated like other villains uh, like other villains who kill who would take long time and remain frustrated this one won't be frustrated because he will feel himself luckier that he got saved from committing a big mistake okay this is the correct explanation of this part mm okay something like that but in a very simple way he will be considered luckier to delay the killing because he won't remain frustrated uh, on the other hand he will moreover he will feel himself luckier that he did not kill him sooner because if he had killed this person then that would have become a big mistake in his life he won't be able to save himself he will and get himself into another big trouble okay that is why he was called luckier okay come to the next one yes no it's not a crime it's not a crime crime is obviously murdering someone is crime but and he has no care for committing a crime or not that won't bother him but this crime will be a big mistake because according to whatever gerard uh, made the plot he was also a wanted criminal he will be telling the thing that he was also wanted criminal so even if you live my life you won't be able to live a free life because police will be um, like looking for gerard as well so that will be a mistake okay so remember the story always okay next question okay next question is the answer will be almost similar what was the big surprise what was the big surprise gerard 
gave to the intruder what was the big surprise gerard gave to the intruder okay the answer will be similar that um, whatever he plan all the plan is going to get fail because uh, he is not a, a noble person he is not just a simple living person he himself was a criminal so even if he is stealing his identity to live his life he won't be free he will be having the threat of getting caught by the police as well okay that was the big surprise okay this you will get in page number 143 page number 143 the games up as far as i am concerned in this dialogue you see um this unfortunately they got one of my men and found things uh the fool should have born tonight i'm expecting trouble this part tonight i'm expecting trouble my bags pack and ready to clear off and then in order to elaborate you just need to add whatever i said before yes according to his plot but you don't mention according to his plot you just say that gerard gave the surprise with by telling this information that whatever i told you okay okay next question how gerard was able to convince how gerard was able to convince the intruder that he himself was a wanted criminal how gerard was able to convince the intruder that he was also Uh, he himself was also a wanted criminal so here you need to tell that um he sh he presented his um packed bag where he had the costume for disguise okay different the costumes are they were present in the bag for disguise then he informed that um that he has posted someone on the road who will be giving one call as soon as he see the he sees the police uh, and uh, then the immediately within some time the phone also starts ringing uh, so this way he was able to convince that whatever he is telling is actually true okay this part you just need to make it short and right first about the bag then about the man posted in the um, road giving signal with the telephone ring acha next question what was the climax what was the climax of the play what was the climax of the play what was the climax of the play the climax of the play was that gerard was not actually a criminal but a very smart man and uh, in order to save himself from the intruder he immediately made a made a plot in his mind claiming himself to be the criminal and on the process he ve he very smartly captured the intruder in his cupboard and called the police okay this is the climax okay so that will be from from this 
chapter and from this exercise question things are all very easy uh, who says this why does he say it is he sarcastic or serious so is he sarcastic or serious here it will be sarcastic okay uh, and why does he say it that a sympathetic audience that dialogue why does he say it because he is trying to reveal that he had such a lonely life there where there had been nobody as such to listen to his life story to be interested in he in listening to his life story therefore he said this okay therefore he said this and he said this obviously in a sarcastic manner not in a serious manner because he was a humor humorous person next why does the intruder choose gerard as the man whose identity he wants is yes, this one is another important question why does the intruder choose gerard as the man whose identity he wants to take on because um because he has the reputation of being a mystery man um he lives alone and he won't he he actually never meets anyone frequently or very often and um, he used he can disappear and appear any time of the day like um, that that was his habit so he felt that his lifestyle would actually suit him okay so this will get in page number 142 the last uh, the last the second last dialogue page number 142 second last dialogue next is next is i said it with bullets who says this gerard says this what does it mean means he killed someone using gun is it the truth it was not the truth it was completely a made up story what is the speaker's reason for saying this he wanted to make up the story to make it more believable for the intruder therefore he said this so next is what what is gerard's profession quote the part of the play that supports your answer so you can quote means like you can just go for this last paragraph of this drama from here only you can get the li uh, line that um, i can't let you have the props in time for rehearsal okay i had a spot to bother i think i will put it in my next play this dialogue i think i will put it in my next play from here it is very clear what is jeras profession obviously he works in a th theater he was a playwright okay uh, you will soon stop being smart this was said by the intruder why does he the speaker say it because um, uh, he was soon going to reveal his real intention for coming here that was killing him which will which he expected to give him some shock and he would shut up means he will like shut his mouth what according to the speaker would will stop gerard from being smart um okay so why does the speaker say it because the speaker was um, speaker would say it because gerard has been talking a lot of things gerard has been asking a lot of question and trying to um appear very smart okay so in order to stop him he he said that thing and uh, according to the speaker what will stop gerard that is this information that he is going to kill him after all this information then they can't hang me twice who says this this was said by the intruder why does the speaker say it because he has already committed a murder and if he is committing the second murder by murdering gerard the punishment will be the same okay therefore he was not afraid to um, afraid to murder another person a mystery i propose to explain what is the mystery the speaker proposes to explain so the mystery was that um that uh, oh, what i said mm. the mystery that uh, normally he won't meet any people uh, he he leads a very mysterious life okay people haven't uh, people often uh, fail to know exactly who he is like whatever okay this mystery that he often goes somewhere suddenly and comes back after such a long time 
okay there is actually no way to track him track his lifestyle so this this is the mystery here is being talked about okay this is your big surprise this i have already said okay okay so that's all for the chapter probable questions and exercise question okay next day that is not tomorrow i think monday monday i will be giving you uh, the um, things from that uh, bigger the chapter bigger okay okay then